Uh, they're off. Five runners break from the stalls for the Group 3 Boodles. Chester Vars first run in 1907. And Hadrianus in the black and white beginning to inch across to the rail leading them at the end of a furlong with Frankie sending a rest pink cap into a prominent position out wide just edging ahead of Adelaide River and Ryan Moore happy at this stage to take the trail from the leading pair and then Galactic Jack dropping in against the running red and the purple and light blue alongside Duke of Oxford who's in the yellow and red and he took a little chivying along when leaving the stalls for the first time we just steady things down a little at the end of a couple of furlongs. Hadrianus with the rest racing enthusiastically. Widest of all, Frankie with a tight hold of his head, but a rest uh, doing it quite keenly in the early part of the race. Galactic Jack is poking up then on the inner of Adelaide River and Duke of Oxford last of the five as they go into the turn and approach the seven marker in the Boodle's chest of ours. So Hadrianus and Franny Norton dictating here at what at times has been a little bit of a stop-start gallop. He's just upped the tempo a fraction, heading towards halfway. Hadrianus taking them along at around about the 32-mile-an-hour mark with Galactic Jack against the running rail and Frankie Wide. Pink cap aboard a rest. In turn, track through by Adelaide River. Moore sitting quietly and Duke of Oxford at the back of the field. Heading on now towards the final five-and-a-half furlongs. Hadrianus made every inch so far. Glancing in behind Frankie aboard arrest just to see where Moore is aboard Adelaide River. Well, he's virtually in Tory slipstream at present. Galactic Jack is coming under pressure, but he needs to make hard work of it. As arrest now moves through to Hadrianus, and they're still half a mile from home. It's going to be a searching test in the conditions, this. Hadrianus, and again, Tory glances in behind, and he'll see that Moore is sitting right on the tail of the leading pair aboard Adelaide River, just nudging him up as Hadrianus begins to falter and arrest commits as they come inside the three frankie nudges away moore is now crouching low on adelaide river and frankie brings arrest wide around the turn moore sticking to the inside on adelaide river a couple of lengths between them hadrianus is now being left behind inside the two it's arrest and frankie in front down the straight moore on the right still working away on adelaide river trying to get to rest but at present the golston horse is still running on strong in front he's opened up by four five six lengths drifting to the near side Dettori glancing across but Arrest looks to have this under lock and key and Frankie's farewell tour of the Rudy will yield a second chest of our success for the Italian maestro Arrest simply far too good for Adelaide River Hadrianus in third the other two are still coming